Hello, welcome to Hats Off. I am Nook, and welcome to Hats Off. As always, I'm terrible at intros. Uh, how you guys doing? How's your week been? Been good? Good. I hope so. I hope your weekend was fantastic. I spent most of my weekend putting together D&D characters, which I'm so excited about. I think we're going to start on Friday. Um, not sure if we're recording or streaming or anything like that. I think we're just going to maybe play... At least a couple sessions and make sure it's going to work out first. But if it does, then maybe you'll see some D&D content on the channel or, you know, via stream or what, whatever. And, um, yeah, we'll, we'll see how that all comes out. Um, but if you saw my Twitter this morning, you saw that I had an interview just now, about an hour ago, I guess. And it went, it went okay. It ended extremely abruptly. And it concerned me, but I think that the lady that I was talking to was just busy and had a really tight schedule uh, because she didn't call me until it was like a phone interview. She didn't call me until the moment that, you know, the clock struck the time that we were supposed to talk. And then like five minutes, like a half hour later, almost exactly, she got off the phone. So I think it was just a time restraint and she realized that she might have been running late. I don't know. I'm not going to think about it too much. I'm going to think about it too much. But I'm going to try not to think about it too much. And in, in order to not think about it too much, I want to play some freaking Dark Souls. <laughs> this came in the mail. I was sitting here like waiting for the call. Had my coffee, my water all laid out. Getting ready for my interview. And then the doorbell rings and there's some guy who doesn't speak English at my door trying to like get me to sign documents to take the order. Whatever. It came. It's here. And I'm super excited and I'm going to start playing it tonight. I've been playing a little bit of... Um, or I've been watching a little bit of um, Terra Mantis play through the version that he got from From Software because he's so really cool and whatever, and I don't care. Whatever. Um, I got mine from Japan a week later than it was supposed to show up, so... <laughs> Bet you're jealous, buddy. Yeah. Um, anyway, I got this cool map. Oh, there's stuff in the back! Whoa! I hadn't looked at that yet. And it's not in Japanese. J Japanese. Sweet. That's awesome. Now I have to decide what I want to put up. I don't want to show it all to you if you're not interested in Dark Souls spoilers. But I have an awesome map. And it's all in Japanese, which makes it look cooler. Because it's like, ooh, I can't read this ancient text of this scroll I found or whatever. Anyway, whatever. Uh, usually I start these off with Q&A. There's no Q&A, because I don't know what's happening with my Chrome, but none of my comments are showing up. So Q&A next week. <laughs> so if you have any questions for me about my life, about what's going on with the channel, what's, I don't know, anything in general you need, I don't know, advice on what chocolates to... to <sighs> you can ask down below in the comments and let me know, and, and we'll talk, and we'll have a nice little hats off conversation. Other than that, I also got a bike in the mail. Probably sounds weird, but it's true. I have to go assemble that at some point. And the explained video is coming along, and I'm still gonna do my goddamn best to get that out by the end of the month, but Dark Souls 3 just showed up, and that's not cool. But also, you're supposed to be here a week ago, you jerk. So, um. What? Yeah, explain video. It's coming along nicely. It looks great. Uh, I'm doing some animation work a lot. A lot more animation work for it than I usually do for videos. And that's actually exciting and really fun for me because I don't get to do a whole lot of animation stuff. And now that I'm forcing it upon myself, it's very time consuming, but I really enjoy it. And it's turning out really, really well. Um, actually made some like 3D, 3D objects within After Effects, which is a 2D program. And it kind of blows my mind a little bit, but it looks really, really cool. And looking forward to getting that out. And then my, my next explained video will most likely be Dark Souls oriented in some way, shape, or form. Whether it's a lore video or if it's a comparison video. Uh, I have a, a few different ideas and I'm not sure which one I'm going to go with yet. But that will definitely be April's explained video. Yeah. So get excited for that. And also the one I haven't released yet. Get excited for it, because <laughs> it's awesome. Um, cut off all my, hair. my roommate cut off all his hair. 
<laughs> I don't think you knew I was recording. Uh, <laughs> How you doing there, buddy? Good. Oh, you haven't cut it off yet. No, I'm going to. Steve's giving me a look. Is this still recording? Yeah, it's totally recording. Hey, everybody. <laughs> That's Tim. <laughs> You might be seeing some things with me and him in the future at some point. We're going to be talking about that later. Um, yeah, so it, it, what? where was I? I don't even know where I was anymore. Get excited about explained videos uh, for this month and also next month and the month after that because that's going to be a thing, in quotes. It is, it is a thing uh, that's going to be happening. <sighs> And I guess uh, say some some have some good thoughts for me about that interview because it'd be nice to, to get that and then I could set up my schedule a lot better and whatever you you know you know about the streams and the whatnots oh I should say I, that's definitely something I forgot to say last week and I should say this week I'm actually gonna go check the exact numbers right now but last week we hit 1500 subs I believe or maybe it was the week before I don't remember exactly. Um, but we are almost at 2,000. We're at 1,593 right now. Almost at 2,000 subs. Um, so it's ex extremely exciting. And uh, thank you guys for supporting. Thank you for everybody new that came by and is hanging out and enjoying the whatever you enjoy on the channel. Whether it's this Monday vlog or the guides or the promises of bigger and better content which are coming soon. Uh, I've also had a lot of people watching my Let's Plays. A lot of people commenting on like To the Moon and Long Dark, which I know that I've talked about bringing back a couple of times, and I do have stuff recorded. I just need to edit it, and it keeps slipping by the web by the website by the wayside. That's the proper term. So I do have a lot of those things, and if you're more interested in seeing some gameplay on the channel, you guys should let me know. Um, if I were to do any Let's Play style thing, it would be in one of two ways. Um, there's a YouTuber named Tears of Grace, and you should definitely go check him out. He's hilarious, and he's funny, and all of his stuff is edited really well with sound effects, and he is actually like a pretty good comedian. He, he has great commentary over his, his videos, and... Um, is great comedic timing and you should just go watch some stuff he's doing Dark Souls 3 playthrough right now and he's really enjoying himself but also like you know goofy antics are ensuing of course because that's kinda what has to happen for a comedy show and yeah it, it's just more highly edited and if I did something like that it would definitely be more rare it wouldn't be a daily thing like it used to be but it's something I've thought about the other way that I would do let's plays, let's I don't want to call it that. The other way I would do gameplay videos would be in the style of how um, Vadi Vidya does playthroughs on his channel. He'll do a playthrough of Dark Souls, and as he's playing through, uh, he's more telling the story of what's happening and cutting the boring stuff <laughs> or the pointless stuff out of out of uh, in between, out of the in between. The in he's cutting the in between. That's the, probably the way to say that. And he's just hitting like the important story points. You know, this is where you start. And this is kind of the kickoff for the main events of the story. And these implications of, you know, whatever, these wall tapestries. Like, what are these wall tapestries? Well, they mean that you're, you're a, a moose or something. I don't know. But he talks through like how everything links together and how it can link to other games. And he does a lot of Dark Souls content. If you haven't heard of him, I don't know how. If you're interested in Dark Souls at all, but you should go watch him. Uh, he does some interesting uh, playthroughs like that. So, it's another thought I've had. And if you guys are interested in seeing anything like that, you should let me know, because I've been thinking about it a little bit. Um, but I'm definitely focusing on the Explained series right now, and we'll see how that goes. So, um... Before I drive myself insane by not playing Dark Souls 3, I'm going to go play Dark Souls 3. And you guys have a wonderful day and a wonderful week. And whatever is, like, holding you back right now on Monday and you're feeling all shitty, just just push it aside, take a deep breath, jump over the hurdle, climb the wall, whatever. That's so many bullshit, like, <laughs> sayings all at once. I believe in you. And I'm, I'm happy that you guys believe in me and the channel and are subscribed. And it means a lot, so... Thank you guys. That's my inspirational whatever for this video. <laughs> Man, I really kind of rushed that one through, and it doesn't sound sincere at all, but I mean it. And uh, 
I'm gonna be focusing on what I just said as I get my butt kicked by all these bosses that I'm not gonna be able to be, read the names of because it's all in Japanese. So, see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot. I really do appreciate it. That was a weird one.